kind of a big deal. Hi, hi guys. Hi, how are you? It's it's me. Um, <clears throat> I know what you're thinking. Oh my God, what's going on? Um, well, you know, YouTube has just been coming down on me really hard. You, YouTube has been coming on me hard. And they, you know, they've just been a little aggressive. So I think it's time that I, I explore my real self. I, um, you know, stop pretending to be something I'm not. And just, just explore the real me. Just get in touch with my, my, my naturalness and finally become comfortable within myself. Wearing this shirt that potentially shows my large areolas. Now... We're just going to switch it. I don't want to get demonetized anymore. I don't want to pretend to be that disgusting individual. And let's just, um, you know, let's switch it up. Let's, let's, let's roll the music. Not the MFing music. Let's roll the music and let's, let's chat, guys. Let's, let's talk about a fragrance. There's some whores in this house. 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 <laughs> don't you ever in your life get it twisted. What you thought? I just found some spiritual cult or some bullshit shit ain't changing you still gonna get the ratch you still gonna get the ratata i don't give a fuck how many videos they demonetize fuck it i'm already spending more than i'm making anyway let's roll my motherfucking music so i can put you on to something that's already above my pay grade but is surprisingly delicious <laughs> Listen, morning, my beautiful peoples. You know who it is. This your boy. See to the U to the B to the A with a button up and shit. You could probably see my big ass nipples. Fuck that. The fragrance that I got on hand is by maybe one of my favorite niche houses in the game. Unfortunately, this shit is like stupid expensive, but fuck it, man. The fragrances is mad good and they're delicious and smooth. And this one. Oh, I just started playing with the bag that they sent me a few months ago and this sample was in there and I was like, oh, this is a vibe. The fragrance is none other than by the House of Fragrance Dubois Santal Complete. Now again, I don't got a full bottle of this shit. Obviously, the 50 ml of this shit runs for like 250. It is what it is. I just got the sample and I got it on this test strip right here. And let me tell you. Let me tell you, as a dude who can appreciate a good Santal fragrance, oh, this is different. This is like creamy Santal. Like you took away the harsh chemical abrasiveness of a Santal 33 by Le Labo. Threw in a little bit of a coconut, creamy Hawaiian tropic chick with like really pasties, smoothed out all the synthetics, added a little bit of love. And you got this motherfucker right here. Here. Now one shit that tweaks my nipples about Santal fragrances, at least some of them. The aroma chemical sometimes is just a little too sharp and a little abrasive on my nose. This one kind of took away that sharp abrasiveness and masked it with a little coconut, son. A little bit of violet up in this bitch. It's got a smooth buttery texture about it. Almost rubbable. Massage parlor, Asian lady, $45 for half an hour and 15 extra for a little <laughs> rubby tuggies. Is it worth the $250? I don't know, but what I can tell you is that this shit is lovely. Definitely not a full-blown Santal fragrance, but a Santal hybrid. A Santal that has the edges all refined and made it so just wearable and pleasant and cuddly, which is not something that I would associate with a Santal fragrance. And I feel like this Santal has a bit of earthiness, a little bit of dirt. I don't know, there's some dried up fruit here, like some dehydrated shit going on. Let's spray this shit on skin. I want to see what this should be doing on my skin, bro. Because if this is something I would consider spending that kind of paper to have some top quality Santal off my pigmentation, I need this shit to smell delicious on my skin. I like a fragrance that I could just blast my nose right into and it's not going to just uh, completely obliterate my nostrils. Although you're not supposed to really be doing that. You're supposed to let the shit breathe just like when you open up a bottle of wine. What you think? I don't drink wine? I'm fucking sensitive. Yeah, what you get here is like the crust of the coconut, like the hairy butthole of the coconut. You just rip that shit open and you smell like the inside. So if you spray the inside of the butthole of the coconut with like a Santal smooth fragrance, added like little rose petals like in the middle of Hawaii or some shit on the island of I want to peek a pee pee, you might find this shit. There's also like an ashy volcano like erupted all over your face. There's ashy, there's earthy, there's Santal, there's violet, woody, coconut, beautiful. 
beautiful fragrance. I don't find the typical oud that you would find of a fragrance to bois because they love to do their organic ouds and shit. I don't find that here to my nose. It's more of just those selective notes that just create this sexy ass composition that makes me just want to spray it all over my body. I think this is an absolutely beautiful fragrance. Again, it's very high on the price point. This is only for the grown and sexy and luxurious lovers in you. This isn't your traditional Santal fragrance. So if you're looking for something very traditional right by the book sandalwood type fragrance, this is not gonna be the fragrance for you. But Fragrance Dubois being who they are, they like to play around with shit and I can't be mad at that because I fucks with it. If the prices were around a 150 price point, I think I would have the whole fucking collection personally. But you know, the way my bank account works is that it's negative right now and wifey tried to hit me with the stun gun a couple of days ago so you already know what time it is. I gotta watch my spending. I love y'all motherfuckers from the hearts. This is definitely a ball sprayer. Excuse me while I dig deep in it. That one, that one went a little too deep behind the balls. I'm not gonna lie, a little drippy right now. It's just unusual to watch your sack like drip and think like, oh shit, I got chlamydia. You should make a candle out of this shit. I love y'all motherfuckers from the heart. Don't ever think I'm gonna dress like that in front of the camera. I'll slap the shit out of you. I'll see y'all bitches next time. You know who it is. It's the biggest in the fucking game. Smooches. Who's best? One of them's gonna pass the test. Who buy? For the fly gun holder, money folder, roller, star when it's time to call back. For the rough, rugged, and raw way, this nigga Jay, it's a game, but he don't play. Hey. For all the chicks that got dead in the penthouse suite on top of my mom's crib. Hey. It's long since you never get in. It's long since you would think that you would. <laughs>